So here we go, y'all. We are four games into this series, and we have a tie score, two to two apiece, and games five and six are coming up today. Should there be a game seven, that's going to be a video in its entirety on its own because we're going to play all three periods of it. But for now, let's see if we can close these boys out in six games. So far, though, it, like I said, it's been a very close series. One goal games, everything. Goaltenders stealing games. It's been a whole lot of playoff drama, really. So let's see if it keeps going today. This game five, lucky for us, is at home. So we get to play two periods. Let's see what happens in the first 20 of Sim. Absolutely no goals. Okay, 0-0. Zero, zero. Let's get it. We got two periods to play. Let's go. I like I like our chances. Come on. Let's just get some gamer subs in my body and let's do this. We have a 40-minute game. Or, yeah, basically a 40-minute game here for us. Oh, let's just dump that in, right? Before we get absolutely crumbled at the blue line. Let's let's start. It. Ah, let's go. That's a statement early. I really wanted that pass. I'm not going to lie. And then the rebound just fell out of my reach. Body check him. Ah. Okay, I'm a little bit annoyed that we didn't get that pass, but it's all good. At least we got a good shot. I'd rather, if they're not going to pass it to me, as long as they don't turn it over, I can't be that mad. But there you go. That's what happens when you pass it to me. The Rangers have a one-goal lead. Philip Heedle on the one-timer. Look at that. What a saucer pass, first of all, from our defenseman to give it to me. Oh, that was beautiful. Then I just split the D and then just hook back right around the skates. Look at that. Nice, beautiful pass. Boom, right to Heedle. Panarin, shout out to Panarin for not getting in the way of that one, getting out of there. And there's not much that the goaltender can do on that one. So let's go. We got that defensive posture. And no, you don't. No, you don't. Okay, apparently you do. That's a decent pass. It gets through the goaltender, but it skips right over the post. Let's freaking get it. Boom, right to the middle. Connor Brown, he's going to get the puck. He's going to try to make a play. It doesn't work. I'm going to go to the bench now because uh, I should have changed like 20 seconds ago. It's all good, though. All right, let's get out of here. Ooh, ooh, that was a bad pass. Somebody tried to pass to me, and that got picked off easily by the Caps. Let's go, let's go. Okay, good stuff. Counter play. We're going to go up the ice, and I'm going to get shadowed pretty, pretty hard on that one. And Panarin's going to draw one. Let's get it. It's five on four power play for the New York Rangers. Mike Hoffman with it. He's going to pass it to me. I'm going to push it ahead. Got to work on that speed. Backhander off the post. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Them the breaks, they're going to happen. We just got to keep our heads down, keep plugging away at it, and they're going to go in eventually. Let's go. Boom. Good pass up the left boards. Let's see if we can gain the zone with a man advantage. There you go. Nice play and a good save, though. And that's pretty much all that happened on that power play. We did not, we were not effective at all, but it's okay, man. We're, we're going to, we're going to figure it out. Okay. Not every power play is going to look dominant. That was a good pass by me, by the way, because we make plays out here. We don't care if we have to take a, uh, take a hit to make them plays. We make them plays. Give me that puck. Let's go. We're going up the ice. I like that. Left side. Boom. Clutchness. Clutchness. Yeah. Down to me. Oh, okay. No, I should have passed it earlier. All right. I thought he was going to come down because he had such a lane, but he didn't. Come on, Heedle. Yes, good tie-up. Yeah, he's going to get the puck. He's, he's going to get his own tie-up because he's a grown man. Back at the point. Let's go. Yo, if you send me this puck, the one-timer, it's going to be blocked. Okay. Yeah, on Carlson. Let's go, John Carlson. That's, that's the Caps' best player. We're going to get this. We're going to go draw him to the right side or to the middle, rather, and we're going to drop it to the left. Boom. Good stuff. Shoot that nice save. I really thought I had a chance at scoring on that one. We're going to go to the net, though, because they're looking to see if they can get a shot. But it's going to be gloved away by the golden glove of Gustafsson. Nothing through the middle. Just keep it to the outside. That's a good poke check. It gets right back on his stick, though, with a nice low pad save in hood. And we took another one. That's not good. Come on, Hedo. We can't have you sitting in the box, Hedo. We got 121 left in the second period, and we kill all of that off. Okay. 40 minutes down in game five, and we have a one goal lead. So 72 sits down to start the third period, and we kill off the rest of his penalty. Let's go. 19 22 left. We're going to get back on the ice. We got this one goal lead. Let's make it a two goal lead. I'm not happy with no one goal lead, bro. This is game five. We can't be leaving it up to chance, all right? And, and when you only have a one goal lead, part of it is luck because, you know, hockey. <laughs> hockey bounces. It just bounced everywhere. Poke check it again. Nothing doing. They go to the opposite point, and my boy is going to make this save. That is not Igor. That is Anifa. Really Igor is hurt. Bro, we... we okay. We need to end this series right now. If we are getting this kind of goaltending from our backup goalie, we need to win this game. There's no freaking way we should we should lose this game. Okay, good stuff. We definitely need that extra goal now. I just realized that it's not him. Yo, to the middle. 
No, okay. We don't we don't want to give them a breakaway though. Let's go. Nice play. Look at that. We came back with the freaking fierceness. I'm gonna get the puck back. Speaking of fierceness, backhander. It's gonna be stopped by Gustafsson. There's no question now that the Caps have the edge in goaltending with Gustafsson in there and our backup in our cage. So let's hope that Chesty's not hurt for too long. That's going to be a tie-up. Caps are going to pick it up. But listen, man, if our backup's going to play like he's played so far... Oh, my God, they almost own goal it because of our pressure. That would have been fantastical, but it didn't happen. That's a great passing play inside. Robbie Fabry with a wrist shot. Not the middle. Daniel Sprong's been scoring a lot of big goals, though, for the Capitals, so we got to be careful about him. No, sir, that's a great defensive play to stop that. From happening and I pushed it too freaking close to my body it's picked off here comes Daniel Sprung we're gonna make sure he has no room because he's been yeah like I said great with the clutch goals and I need to get this puck back oh I'm got I got it into the neutral zone that's fine I'll take that hit for that play any day of the week we need to make that happen okay Yakum, let's go get hit I'm going to the bench because I'm tired as hell we're jumping over the boards with a power play. Let's go. Five on four advantage. We need this second goal. We need it. Boom. Give it to me. I'm going to cross to the middle. I wanted my teammate to open up. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, he whiffed. He whiffed on it. No. Por que? Por que do whiff? <laughs> it's all good. It's going to go all the way back down the ice. It's, it, it's fine. We're going to regenerate some offense. Philip Heedle coming up. Oh, with the deke. He's going to go down low. Panarin picks it up. Down to me, please. Thank you. Appreciate it. To Heedle. Genos. Oh, what a stop. What a stop by Gustafson. Shoot that front of point with a tip. Nothing. Panarin picks it up to me. One timer is a snipe. And the Rangers have a two goal lead. What an absolute bomb right off the post and in from a sharp angle. You can't stop me. You can't stop me with that kind of angle. I do this. I do this. I am pr the professor of angles, okay? The grand professor of angles. I don't care if it's sharp. Let's go. That was a bomb. Nothing to do for Gustafson. I kind of sort of feel bad about, for him, not going to lie. I don't care. I don't care, though, because we needed that second goal. Two nothing blue shirts, and now, now we can breathe, and we can close, well, focus on closing out the game. We don't want to play 100% defense because it's 11 minutes left, and that's a whole lot of time, but we still, we like being here better than where we were before. I should have shot that on the other side, but it's all good. Gustafson's going to make that. Coach, stop. Stop. Seriously, you need you need to stop this. Please just take your man. Take your man. And I'll do, I'll do my best to take the one that you failed to take. Oh, nice play to keep that in. Right to the high slot. And somebody tripped Buchnevich. I don't think it was me. Doesn't really matter who it is. It's not me. It's Ryan Ellis. Yeah, dang it. I think he's on our power play. Or our penalty kill. That's unfortunate. Okay, we kill it off. Regardless, it's still 2 nothing Rangers. Let's go. Man, NFL, I like that. It's NFL stepping up. I swear, if we got on the ice just to be told that we're going to be killing another penalty. Oh, no, we're going to be on the power play. Let's go. Five on four advantage. Let's not throw it away. Let's end the game. If we score right here, this is pretty much GG's. Let's go. Good face off win to Panarin. His slap shot is going to be stopped by Gustafson. Heedle picks it back up to Panarin. He shoots again. He's gunning. He's gunning, and I thought he was going to be hurt for a second, but he's not. That was a pretty useless power play, not going to lie. But, oh, that looks like somebody else took one because we're still on the power play. Five on four. Get me out here, please. All right. Oh, but is going to draw another one. The Caps are the caps are shooting themselves in the foot. They just keep taking penalties late in a game that they need two goals to tie. Let's go. That is the, just, just too much pressure. They can't, they can't deal. They can't handle the pressure of playing the New York Rangers. They can't handle the truth. Let's go, Heedle. Win it to me. Put Aaron. He shoots and scores. Our Demi Panarin closes the books on this one. GG's. It's pretty much over at this point. Three nothing for the Rangers. Let's freaking go. We're still on the power play too. Mm. <laughs> We're gonna get some speed out of it, and I they played me a little bit harder than I thought they would. It's all good. We got nope, no room for the Michigan. Not on this one. We tried. We tried to see if we could get it, but no. Oh, please get in there. No. All right. It's all good. We don't need another goal. We would just like it as a message. Yeah. Speaking of message, sit down with a body check. That's gonna be me off the ice. I think that's the last of uh, of the first line's work here in game five. Dominant performance. Rangers coming out. Huge. Yes, sir. Huge jobs, bud. We win. 3-0. Hannafelt getting a shutout. 
That is awesome. I think, yeah, yeah, like they're saying on the commentary, that is his first playoff shutout. Good for you, kid. Good for you. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Getting back in the locker room. We outshot the cast almost by double digits. The final shots on goal were 38 to 29 for the blue shirts. You love to see that. One goal, three assists. Or one goal, two assists, three points, plus one, seven shots. How many hits? How many hits? Okay. Okay. Six hits. It's not bad. We played 22 minutes in that game. That is a lot. We have a goal per game through 11 games in the playoffs. And here comes the most important one. Game six. We could eliminate the Capitals if we win. Or they could force game seven with a home win of their own. So let's see what happens. Two periods of sim. First one, no goal still. Second one, 2 nothing lead for the Rangers. And I got a goal in the sim. You'll love to see it. Let's freaking go. All we got to do is play a good 20 minutes of hockey. And we are out. We done. We're going to the conference finals. Let's go. We're dropping a puck on a third period. 20 minutes left in the Capitals playoff lives. Get it up to me, please. Get, please, please. Thank you. I appreciate it. That was a little bit too late, but it's all good. Right to the middle. And he can't score. It's fine. But just come back. Just come back defensively. Be in good posture. Make sure that there's no odd man rushes or anything of the sort. Yep. Carson's going to get hit again. Let's go. That's just what I do. I get these body checks in here. And just, nope. I'm like I'm like Dustin Brown, except I'm talented, you know? It's kind of that. It's a mix between Dustin Brown and... Oh, Vetchkin! Speaking of which, that was a massive one-timer, and Anifel kept it out. Are you kidding me? That is some great goaltending. This man is in a zone right now. And the coach calls for a change, but I call for good defense, so we're not going to change on that but, uh, that back check back at the point it goes I thought again he was gonna shoot maybe I should just L1 crouch blocked the, ah, the freaking shots and I, of course of course I couldn't get that through I called for a puck I didn't mean to I wanted I thought this man was gonna get board played but as Ryan Ellis pricks the puck up the ice we're gonna oh my goodness they got a pretty good chance out of it too and that gives me a chance to change two zip for the Rangers still 1540 left in the game let's go Let's go. We'll just take it one shift at a time. Let's be calm about this. Not do anything stupid. That shot's going to go wide. Pick this up. There you go. Nothing stupid. Around the boards. We could have forced multiple plays. We're forcible on that one, but we didn't want to do it. Okay? That's all we got to do. If we play smart like that, we're going to come out with a W. We're going to dump that around the boards because we didn't have room. And we're going to come back defensively. And we're just going to be really annoying to play against, basically, uh, for the Capitals. Uh, that's a body check on Carlson. It wasn't a big one, but, I mean, we bumped him. We let him know that we were there. And here come the Caps on the... Oh, nice poke check. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Panarin, up to me. Yes, sir. And he didn't play me as hard as I thought he would, but it's all good. We're going to drop that in a wonderful save. Oh, by their goaltender, a slap shot is blocked. The Caps are fighting for their lives out here, and you can tell. And I'm just, I did not mean to shoot that. Did not mean to shoot that. I let go of the buttons an hour ago, but y'all know how it does, man. Y'all know how the game works as Anna Felt stops the Caps on a huge chance. Right through the middle of the ice, another huge save. A slap shot from the point is stopped, and Anna Felt's making a name for himself here. This is getting, this is getting to that, oh, he might actually be a decent point. And that's a good shot. Off of the spin move that completely wrecked my defender. Luckily for us, Gustafson holds on to it, and that's a free change. Yeah, Nick Backstrom, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, you've been playing great, but it looks like uh, it looks like the Rangers got your number, son. It looks like we just might be decent. Get me back out here on the ice. Oh my lord, look at Philip Heedle in all the room he has. He scores. Yeah, you can't you can't give Philip Heedle that much room, bro. 35 goal score. He's gonna, he's gonna take that to the freaking house every single time, man. Let's go. What a snipe. What a snipe. I didn't even have to do anything. I just came back on the ice and, and saw saw Heedle do great stuff. You know? Let's go. Just greatness. 3-0. Rangers. Oh, that feels good. That feels real good. This is the team that injured me last season. This is, uh, we played our last game against the Caps last year. And after that, we lost in the conference finals. Obviously, I couldn't play because I was injured. But we lost in the conference finals to the Tampa Bay Lightning. So it feels great to come back here and hand him an L if we are indeed able to close this out, which it's not over. It's not over. We're not acting like it's over, but I'm just saying this is the this is the setup. Oh, no, not at the point. That's a good poke check. We're going to get this puck back. Another poke check. Look, we're just our sticks are everywhere. We are just making it so difficult for the Caps to do anything. Frankly, we can't really get out of our zone like they are. They're playing very aggressively and we don't really have an answer. 
But you know what? We are keeping them to the outside. They're not getting that many grade A chances. Now there's a delayed penalty. I don't even need anything special on the power play. We just need to keep the puck and kill two minutes off the clock. That puck is going to be picked off by the Caps. And obviously they're going to be pretty... Um, Pretty aggressive on the puck, even though they're killing a penalty because they get... Yeah! They need three goals. Okay, to tie the game. We're going to go to the far side, and that was awful. That was absolutely awful. My pass was intercepted, as it should have been. And let's come back defensively. No, no. Let's go. If you're going to turn the puck over, just make sure you're there defensively. Quarter of a period to go. We have a three-goal lead. I'm liking this. This could be our last or second-to-last shift here, basically. Here comes Robbie Fabry. He is a great player, though. He can get some goals in gameplay in this game. Couple of passes. Leads to a sharp angle shot. Easily handled by NFL. And here come the Caps down in the corner. They're getting a low cycle going. We're going to try to shut it down. But at the same time, nobody's going to the net for Washington. So that's... You can't really do that and expect huge chances. And there you go. We're going to turn it over as we try to get out of our zone. But there you go. It leads to a play for Panarin. Panarin has a lane. He deeks and unfortunately turns the puck over, but here we go, back on defense. Let's just shut the game down. That's what we're doing, man. That's Listen, I know that this is, oh, this is not super high-octane offensive gameplay, but we saw a big goal last game, right? We saw that. Now it's time to just play maturely. We're going to shoot that. I didn't want to get killed. I could have tried to deke him. I did not want to get hit on that one. Uh, not, not the time. Listen, if it's a close game, I'll take the hit, but in this one, I just, I don't want to risk it, man. Y'all know how Rammer do. That's a great feed by Backstrom. It's going to be stopped by Annafelt, though. He's a grown man. He is stopping so many pucks right now. 3.51 left in the game. Are we going to get another shift? Yes, we are. 1.12. Let's go. I know in 1.12, that's, that's a, not a lot of time for three goals, but I still want to take this shit seriously, man. Let's go. We come back. Nope. No passes through the middle. No, nothing. S stack the blue line. Yep, good stuff. Look at that. Look at that. The Rangers actually playing some structured defense. Ha who would have thought, man? Who would have thought? I guess this team just kind of kind of got tired of getting its ass beat in the, uh, in the playoffs by lack of defense, eh? I guess that's just what happened. And now, we can't, like I said, we can't get out of our zone, but... They can't really get a chance either. Like, look at us. We are just shutting them down, keeping them to the outside. They're not going to score from the corner, you know? And if we keep them in the corner, that's that's pretty much what they're going to have to do. They don't, though. Let's go. That's me off the ice, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's the first line off the ice. That was a good shift. Panera with a shot. He's going to be stopped. The rebound also stopped by Gustafson. But that is going to be it. 15 ticks left. We're going to simulate. Zero ticks left. 3 nothing. Huge jobs by the Rangers. Back-to-back -back shutouts by our backup goalie on the heels of some pretty darn good defense. He made some great saves as well, though. I'm not taking it away. He, he deserves both of those shutties. And we're moving on to the conference finals. Let's freaking go. Love to see it, man. Man, our, I can't believe this man got two shutouts. I legitimately can't believe it. But here comes the handshake line. We're going to shake the hand of their captain, Nick Backstrom. And that's going to be GG's. Let's go. I don't think we scored that many points this game, but it doesn't really matter, man. We had a good defense. Oh, actually, we got two points. There you go. Two points, one goal, one assist. That's what you love to see. And look at us. He is our still averaging a goal per game in the playoffs because we are just that kind of guy. All right, we are just that kind of guy out here. When it gets down to the nitty-gritty and you need some Ws, yeah, boy, will come up clutch. Oh, we're taking on the Leafs. Let's go. We're taking on the Toronto Maple Leafs in the conference finals. Love to see it. What's going to be the other two teams in the Frozen Four, though? Let's go find out right now. It's going to be the Leafs and Rangers versus, ooh, the Avs and Canucks. So there's a chance. There's a, It's not 50% because that's not how sports odds work, but there's a chance that there is an all-Canadian Stanley Cup final, and Toronto-Vancouver is probably one of the greatest matchups that you could have for that to happen. Like, right right next to Toronto-Edmonton, that would be absolute just, just civil war in Canada, honestly. But, man, that's going to be two great series, and it's going to be fun, man. Buffalo got their ass beat. Four to one series. They they get lost in five games. So Toronto's coming off a little bit more rest than us, but we didn't go to seven, so we, we still had a few days of rest. So we're gonna be fine. Let's freaking go, man. Vancouver, six games to get by Los Angeles. It's all good. And same thing. No, actually, no, that was a sweep for Colorado. Four nothing to 
the Avalanche, I told y'all, I told y'all at the beginning of this playoff run that Colorado would be a serious freaking contender, and here they are. One loss through two rounds. That's crazy. That's crazy, man. We're probably going to end up facing them, but I don't know. It's going to be all in the next video, man. Ooh. Oh, I'm liking this. I'm liking this. We're going to get to the lineup in the next video. We're going to get to our lineup for now. Is Igor... Yeah, Igor is still hurt. And listen, he had an 889 save percentage through the playoffs so far. Whereas our our, our boy, Anifel... I'm going to call him my boy. Who is this Martinek? Okay, he is 76 overall. Let's not have him. You are 82 overall. Listen, man, this kid, 936 save percentage. That's the same save percentage that Gustafson came into the Ranger series with. So, you know what? He's given us some really, really good goaltending. And he's on a shutout streak, so you love to see it, man. Great, great display. Offense, defense, goaltending, everything from the New York Rangers. It feels like it's all coming together, doesn't it? I, that's just my my assessment of the situation. I feel like this team has awoken and we are finally reaching our potential. But I hope you enjoyed this video, man. And if you did, please hook your boy up and push the like button in the face. Spend a lot of it. Comment and subscribe. I'm G20, man. As always, I love you guys. Thank y'all so much for your time. And I'm out this bitch. Peace.